hello everyone welcome back to my channel brain equation today we are going to solve a question 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2x plus 7 to the power 3x is equal to 14 so x is unknown so we need to calculate x let's begin so i will write the statement of the question 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2x plus 7 to the power 3x is equal to 14 so in the first step I will use a identity of exponent that is if we are given with a to the power m a to the power m is given to the n to the power n n a to the power m to the power n is given then we can interchange their powers n can be written inside the parentheses and m can be written outside the parentheses so i'm going to use this uh, property here in the first step of this question so 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power x parentheses 2 so i will write 2x as x2 so it, similarly i will use the um, property here 7 to the power x oh, parentheses 3 to the power 3 is equal to 14 so here we have 7x, 7x and 7x. So here we can make our substitution. The let let consider the 7x we will make our substitution. Uh, 7x is equal to m. So we will plug in the value of 7x in the above equation and we will get m plus m square because 7x is m and m square plus m cube it is cube is equal to 40 so in the next step now m plus m square plus m cube i will bring 14 on the other hand side minus 14 is equal to 0 so in the next step m plus m square plus m cube 14 can be written as 8 plus 4 plus 2 is equal to 0 so next step m plus m square plus m cube minus 8 can be written as 2 cube 4 can be written as 2 square plus 2 same is parenthesis is equal to 0 so in the next step m plus m square plus m cube i will open the parenthesis minus 2 cube minus plus will give minus 2 square minus plus will give 2 minus 2 is equal to 0 now in the next step i will write same powers together m cube minus 2 cube similarly m square can be written with with minus 2 square and m can be written with 2 plus m minus 2 is equal to 0 so in the next step i will write them in parentheses m q minus 2 q parentheses plus m square minus 2 square plus m minus 2 so from here i will use uh, the basic algebraic formulas that if we are given a square minus b square is equal to a minus b and a plus b so the second formula a cube minus b cube it can be written as a minus b a square plus a b plus a b it is a b plus b square so i'm going to use these two formulas in the next step for m cube minus 2 cube i will use a cube minus b cube and for m square minus 2 square i will use a square minus b square so m minus 2 
a minus b here we will write m square m square plus 2m and 4 because the b is 2 2 square is 4 so the other formula for the other expression m minus 2 m plus 2 plus m minus 2 will remain same is equal to 0 so now in this expression we have m minus 2 here in the second expression m minus 2 m minus 2 so we can take m minus 2 as common we can take it common m minus 2 and we will write in the parentheses m square plus 2m plus 4 parentheses plus here we will left with m minus 2 is taken common and so m plus 1 plus here we will left with 1 is equal to 0 so in the next step m minus 2 here we will open the parentheses m square plus 2m plus 4 plus m plus 2 plus 1 parentheses is equal to 0 so m minus 2 m minus 2 so we are here m square plus 2m and 4m gives 3m plus 4 plus 2 plus 1 will give 7 plus 7 parenthesis is equal to 0 so from here we have two type of expression m minus 2 is equal to 0 or m square plus 3m plus 7 is equal to 0 m square plus 3m plus 7 is equal to 0. So in the next step, from m minus 2, m minus 2 is equal to 0. m minus 2 is equal to 0, which implies that m is equal to 2 recall here here we will recall our substitution that uh, m is equal 7x is equal to m that 7x was equal to m so here we will have m is equal to 2 so we have 7x is equal to 2 here we have m is equal to 7x and 7x is equal to 2 so here we have 7x is equal to 2 so we will take log on both sides log on both sides log 2 so here we will use the for the i one the i property of the log that if we are given with log a to the power b then b will shift here so log b times log a so here we are going to use this property for log 7 to the power x so x will shift here in log 7 is equal to log 2 so in the next step we will bring log 7 to the right hand side x is equal to log 2 over log 7 so we will use the property of logarithm x is equal to log 2 if log 2 over log 7 is given we can write log 2 to the base 7 so it is the value uh, solution of the given equation the real solution so in the next step uh, we have a quadratic equation now we will take that quadratic equation m square plus 3 m plus 7 is equal to 0 so we will take this quadratic equation from this quadratic equation we will have two solutions 7 is equal to 0 so a is equal to 1 here coefficient of m square is 1 b is 3 coefficient of m is 3 and c is 7 so we will use quadratic formula that is minus b plus or minus b 
square minus 4ac over 2a. So plug in the values of a, b and c. m is equal to minus 3 plus or minus b square is 3 square. 3 square minus 4 times 1. a is 1. c is 7 times 7 over 2 times 1. So m is equal to minus 3 plus plus or minus square root square root 9 minus 4 times 1 times 7 will give 28 over 2. So in the next step m is equal to minus 3 plus or minus 9 minus 28 will give minus 19 minus 19 over 2 so m is equal to minus 3 minus 3 plus or minus minus 19 can be written as 19 times minus 1 over 2 m is equal to minus 3 plus or minus mm, it can be written as 19 square root 19 times square root minus 1 over 2 so m in the next step m is equal to minus 3 plus or minus minus 1 square root gives i square root 19 over 2 so here we will recall we will recall our substitution again that was that it was 7x is equal to m so here we will plug in the value of m that is 7x so we will get 7x is equal to minus 3 plus or minus i na square root 19 over 2 so by taking log on both sides now we will take log here on both sides log 7x is equal to log minus 3 minus 3 plus or minus plus or minus i square root 19 over 2 bracket so the use by using the property of the logarithm we will get x log 7 is equal to log minus 3 plus or minus i square root 19 over 2. So here bring log on right hand side log 7 on right hand side and we will left with x on left hand side x is equal to log minus 3 plus or minus i square root 19 over 2 over log 7. So in the next step we will use the property of logarithm we can write log minus 3 plus or minus i square root 19 over 2 to the base 7 so it is the value of x this solution value of x the solution from here we will get two solution one is with plus sign one is one is with minus sign So in the next step, I will write all three solutions together. All three solutions together. So x1 is here we have x1. x1 is log 2 to the base 7. And x2 is log 
लॉग माइनस थ्री प्लस आई स्के रूट नाइनटीन ओवर टू ओवर टू टू देश सेवन एंड एक्स थ्री इज लॉग माइनस थ्री माइनस आई स्के रूट नाइनटीन ओवर टू टू देश सेवन सो इफ वी हैव वन रियल सोल्यूशन x1 is the real solution and the x2 and x3 these both are the complex solution because they involve the imaginary part i these are the complex solution so now we need to check the um, uh, real solution we will verify we will write the equation 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2x 7 to the power 3x is equal to 14 we will take the left hand side of this equation and we will plug in the value of x and then we will prove left hand side is equal to 7 to the power x 7 to the power x plus 7 to the power 2x plus 7 to the power 3x so plug in the value of x 7 to the power that is log 2 to the power uh, base 7 plus 7 2 times 2 times log 2 to the base 7 plus 7 log 3 times log 2 to the base 7 so in the next step we will write 7 log 2 plus this 2 will shift and it will become power so 7 log 2 to the power 2 to the base 7 plus 7 this 3 will shift uh, as a power will become power log 2 to the power 3 to the base 7 so by the property of the logarithm we have property of log logarithm if a to the power log If a to the power log b to the base a is given, this is the uh, it, it, this expression is given, so then it can be written as b a to the power log b over uh, to the power base a is given, then it is equal to b. So here we have two seven to the power log two to the base seven. We have two here. So left hand side. Of this equation is equal to seven. Here we will get two because it is equal to two, and in this expression it is equal to to the square. And here we will get two cube according to this formula. So two plus four plus eight is equal to fourteen, which is equal to right hand side. So. it is uh, proved we have used this uh, solution and we have verified by uh, using the equation so the it was a great challenge don't forget these steps these steps are very important and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more solutions and videos like this till the next video bye